My name's Riley Kyle Dignan. I'm a small content creator from Southeast Michigan. I am gay, trans, mentally ill, and ready to rock your world. Success on YouTube is honestly something I feel like I've already achieved. To me, it means being able to reach out to people, to help people, provide a laugh when they need one, and a shoulder to cry on. Even with my small platform, I feel like I found a family within my viewers that I'll never replace. I feel like my purpose is to educate others, specifically on issues pertaining to the LGBTQ plus community and destigmatizing mental illness. Alongside that though, I like to make fun stuff. Stuff that can brighten someone's day even for just a second. Being able to connect with people who relate and have gone through similar things, and people that can laugh alongside me, is something that I wouldn't trade for the world. YouTube has grown tremendously since its beginnings, and I think that's incredible. And I think through the growth, a lot of us have found our particular niches that we have found content that we want to create. Places where we find loads of support and community and friendship. So I think it's less about dealing with YouTube's growth and more about embracing it. I feel like the content I make is pretty unique. Being a non-binary trans man who is also gay and mentally ill, it's kind of difficult to find people who make serious content that I do relate to. But different from a lot of other queer creators on the platform is that I don't just create videos pertaining to being queer. I also like to do routines, hauls, comedy, and things like that among my serious videos. And I feel like that's something you don't always see. With all these new content creators popping up, I feel like it's a great opportunity for collaboration. And for friendships we wouldn't otherwise have. I know that since YouTube has grown so much, I've made friends through the platform that I wouldn't have otherwise. In my opinion, it's the more people, the merrier. Being a smaller creator has its ups and downs, but I think a huge benefit of it is that we have more creative freedom. Without a huge audience breathing down our necks, we kind of are free to experiment with the content we want to create, without us being pushed into a box of what we are supposed to create. And to me, that box seems pretty difficult to get out of. Plus, it's a lot easier for smaller creators to connect directly with their audience. Not saying I don't want to grow, because I do, but it's nice to be able to reply to all the comments and DMs you get without missing any. Anyways, thank you for watching my audition video for VidCon 2017's less than famous panel. I hope you enjoyed and I really hope you'll consider me. Goodbye!